Crusades Weather on the A's with meteorologist Christine Ferreira. Good morning, everyone. The sun coming up around 6.55 this morning. Look at Lebanon right now. You can just see a little hint of light on the horizon. It's one below zero. Extremely cold when you factor in the wind. And wind chills right now are ranging around 20 below zero. Here's the News 8 Storm Team forecast from Delta for you today. We're doing sunny skies, diminishing winds with wind chills around zero this afternoon. So although we're 20 below this morning, wind chills will improve as high pressure builds overhead. Tonight, increasing clouds, Calm and cold will slip into the single digits again, but I do expect clouds to come in early tomorrow and moderate our temperatures just a bit. Now, the snow making system that's coming in tomorrow has sped up just a touch, so I do expect snow to be developing by midday now. Most areas receiving two to five inches of snow by evening, with a brief changeover to a mix before we go over into rain late Saturday night into early Sunday. So, rain is at the tail edge of the system. Most of it will be snow, and most of it coming from midday through evening tomorrow. Here are the temperatures right now around zero on nearly everywhere you look. In Harrisburg, we have tied the record so far this morning, holding steady at that zero mark. It's two below in Sealands Grove, one below in Lancaster, up to eight below in Lewistown. And here's the number that really matters. When you step out the door, this is going to hit you in the face. These wind chills, wind chills around 20 below are dangerously cold. And that means that you can get frostbite within 30 minutes on exposed skin. So if you plan to be outdoors for an extended period of time today, please make sure you cover all exposed skin. Wind chills do improve a little bit at lunchtime, but we are still sub zero. Stopping the clock for you at 5 p.m. Finally, chills have gone above zero, but only for a short period of time. I think wind chills will hover near zero in the overnight hours through early tomorrow. Live on Super Doppler 8 right now, we are clear, we are dry. High pressure over the southeast is starting to build in. We take a look over the northern Rockies, though, for our next weather system, part of it developing here. And as it moves toward the Midwest, it will form into low pressure that will bring us snow tomorrow. So here's how the predictor sees it for today. Clear skies, hardly a cloud out there with high pressure parked overhead. Tonight, winds diminish. We stay clear until clouds come in early tomorrow. Now watch the timing on the snow here. By midday tomorrow, it's across the Susquehanna Valley. And we'll see a light to moderate snow there through evening before that quick changeover late at night and then clearing early Sunday. So I still think there may be some clouds, some drizzle around Sunday morning, maybe some showers. But after that, we have the potential of seeing a little sun there on Sunday with warmer highs. Expected accumulations for you going with two to five inches through most of the Susquehanna Valley. The closer you get to Wilmington and Philadelphia, the lower the totals. The closer you get to the central part of the state, especially the mountains, Altoona, State College, Lewistown, you're going to be closer to five or up to seven inches max there. So here's the extended forecast for us guys today. Record breaking low temperatures, record breaking high temperatures. We could even set a record low for tonight. Finally, no more record breaking stuff as we head into the weekend. Temperatures moderate, but we'll be in the 20s next week. Yeah. Oh, yeah, then we're just like 10 degrees below. <laughs> so, you know, this 20 sounds a little yeah, better right now, now, doesn't it? <laughs> All right, thank you. Thanks.